equity value versus enterprise value. We're going to break down the enterprise value and equity value of a business with an illustration for you. The value of a company is the sum of all of its assets. Those assets are used to generate cash flow, and they are what the business is actually worth. That's what's known as the enterprise value, the value of the entire firm, the value of the entire enterprise. But a company has a capital structure. Those assets were purchased or financed with a combination of debt and equity. So on the other side of this diagram, we're going to show you how capital structure impacts what these shareholders own. Let's suppose these assets were financed 25% with debt and 75% with equity capital. What that means is, after deducting what the debt investors have helped finance, you have what's left over for the shareholders. So what's left to the shareholders is the equity value of the business, but the value of all the assets of the entire company is the enterprise value. Let's take another look here at a house example. Imagine three different houses. Each of these houses is financed in its own way. The first house is financed with a $100,000 mortgage and $400,000 equity. The second house is financed with a $400,000 mortgage and $100,000 equity. And finally, the third one is financed with $250,000 mortgage and $250,000 equity. So, the question is, what is the house worth in each of the three cases? Well, it's actually a trick question because all three are exactly the same. The funding mix for the house does not impact its valuation. So thinking about a home and the mortgage on a home is an easy way to think about enterprise value and equity value. If someone asks you what your home is worth, you would typically give them the value of the whole house, the enterprise value. Rarely would you tell them the equity value. So... In business valuation, we think of it in the same way. If you want to think about what an entire company is worth, then you're thinking about its enterprise value. If you want to know what just the amount that's worth for the shareholders is, then that's the equity value. 